called Thanksgiving creep stores opening on Thanksgiving instead of Black Friday. Now, Assemblywoman Lorena Gonzalez wants Thanksgiving workers to get a raise. But 10 News reporter John Horn found out that her efforts won't necessarily pay off for all of them. This downtown McDonald's will be open for limited hours on Thanksgiving Day, but when it comes to the hourly rate the employees are getting paid, nothing's going to change. The restaurant closes at 4 on Thanksgiving, but one employee told me off camera that she's not getting holiday pay, even though she has to work. So you're taken away from the family when you have people work on the holiday, so they should be accommodated uh, monetarily. San Diego Assemblywoman Lorena Gonzalez agrees. She's retooling legislation to get some workers double pay on Thanksgiving. Gonzalez is targeting major retailers like Macy's, Target, Toys R Us and Walmart, all who have increased their Thanksgiving hours over the last few years to compete with online sales. Not just now on Black Friday, not just at midnight on Black Friday, but um, well into the day on Thanksgiving. Thing is, many major retailers like Target already sweeten the pay for Thanksgiving workers. Gonzalez says she would like to help fast food employees who have been pushing for $15 an hour, but there isn't the political will, so she's sticking to retail. You have to start somewhere. It is clear we are targeting an industry that can um, choose to do more. Gonzalez says her original bill, which included Christmas, brought concerns from business groups and hotels who felt they had to stay open on the holidays. John Horn, 10 News. We reached out to the local McDonald's franchise co-op, but they declined to comment. Gonzalez says that her bill would still need some seasonal or non-union retail workers. She can help them because they won't necessarily get a boost on Thanksgiving.